Burr here. Just prepping uh, for the, uh, the debut of the Tom DeLonge Gibson. Ooh. A lot of people ask, Kurt, uh, why are you drunk all the time? What, what are you doing? Well, I'm not drunk, I'm sober. And I'm going to explain some very, uh, some very important things about my recording for guitar today. So just looking around, we got the computer, we got the uh, the interface, that thing there, computer. We got monitor speakers. We got headphones. We got an amp, a couple of mics, and all this fun stuff. So, guitar is going into the pedals. They're all being powered by this brick, by uh, MXR. Keeps everything going good. Then I'm going into the AC30 normal, no, low gain top boost channel. A little bit of reverb on it. And yeah, there's, there's the uh, SM57, the Shure. And the Audio Technica something or other microphone, condenser mic. So those are going into this. Presonus audio box interface, and then I record in a garage band. And there is my fancy lighting setup. Yeah. yeah. I got that from uh, the crew that works with Steven Spielberg on, on, on big films. Jurassic Park used this lighting rig. Oh, what else? Uh, Hundreds of movies use this same setup, so pretty pro. Then I got some some little cheat cheat notes here. I usually always have something because my memory's not that good, especially full or uh, full album covers. Now delays on right now. Another delay. The MXR EVH flanger. Phase 90, MXR, Chorus Ensemble, my Full Drive 2, Boost, Super Overdrive, and Tuner. Now this here, this, this, I don't know whose this is, this, this is just, here, there's a diddly bow up top. There's all kinds of weird stuff. Uh, no, this is one of the, the roommates I live with. This is his guitar rig. And then uh, there's my bass amp. The old Ampeg Micro VR. A uh, X-Men uh, Sentinel. Blink Bunny. Imperial Shuttle. Anybody in there? No. No. Nobody's in there. Maybe later someone will show up. Maybe a spider will crawl in there or something. I don't know. Anyways, and then uh, a couple guitars. Mike Dern bass, pink Mark bass, green Mark bass, American P bass. The old drum kit. Haven't used that. You'll have to wait for something special with that. Uh, wooden poster Metallica. Just just because it's cool. Kind of. Yeah, yeah, it's cool, I guess. Okay. So I'll just give you a little... little peek at the old... the old setup there, but here we go. So... That's where the guitar mics come through, and then... Ah! Ah! Oh, that was bright. Sorry, sorry. Okay, so I'm just I'm gonna mute that because I'm pissing around still figuring it out. But yeah, so we got the song, and then I don't know what's. <laughs> Focus. Will that focus? 
focus? Eh? You gonna focus? No, no. Well, those are the base settings that I have for base recording. So uh, that'll be in like a pre base video recording thing, maybe? Yeah, we'll do that. Now for this video, I'm gonna be, um, I'm gonna be plugging in headphones, those little guys there, into this, I think, or this, it's one of these things. And, uh, cause I can't hear, cause I have to have the amp really loud. So, yeah, there's, there's that, there's a mandolin. There's some of the old classic posters from the other rooms too, hang around the wall. Yeah, little, little peek outdoors. Oh, and the the light is blue. It's kind of like a burlesque club meets brothel meets um, a s slave dungeon of S and M weird kinky stuff in here, or just an innocent room that guitar covers get recorded in. It's 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 both. It's a little bit of both, but uh, we won't we won't get into that. We 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 won't talk about that anymore. So yeah, so the, 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 I'll give you a little quick look at the, the Tom DeLonge guitar too, because it's, it's pretty neat. People want me to do uh, like a, what do you call it, comparison I guess, a comparison of this one and the Epiphone one, because I have it as well. So yeah, it's, you know, it's got the nice Spurzel locking tuners on it, little Tommy's little... Uh, Stamped on signature, even though it's the Gibson, he still doesn't sign it, um, which is to be expected. Most artist series aren't signed. Then uh, got the old dirty fingers pick up in there. Same as the Epiphone one. The finish you can't. It's hard to tell because I got blue light and yellow light. Well, it's professional Jurassic Park set lighting and all this stuff going on. So. It is almost identical color to the Epiphone one. Um, someone pointed out that this is closer to the end of the guitar, the input, and the knob is a little bit of a different color. It's like a clear yellow thing. And it's a, it seems a little bit thinner maybe. Not by much, but a little, a little bit. And I don't have strap locks on it right now. I should put some strap locks on it. And uh, the neck is also a little bit thinner, radius-wise. It just it feels like a like a three thirty-five neck, like a traditional Gibson. So yeah. And uh, there's the back. Ooh, it doesn't look like anything. Um, well, I've rambled on for almost eight almost nine minutes we're getting up to nine minutes so you're probably sick of this awkward vlog I guess you could call it those are the speakers I used to Alices El Elise Alices M1 active Al Alices yeah no I'm just kidding I, I know how to say it it's Alices um they work okay they, uh, they do the job um, I use those, oh no, wait, I won't tell you anything about bass, because that'll be the next vlog I do, so. Yeah, there's a little happy fun land there, I just gotta stand in that one spot, and try not to fall over. Huh. That's not my keyboard either, I don't know whose that is, someone left that here. Oh, and there's a camera. That's, that's what broadcasts this to the world. So all you lovely people can see it. Now I'm going to go uh, change my shirt and put shoes on because the pedals hurt my feet and I should probably comb my hair so I look good. You don't want to see what I look like before the video. No one wants to see that. So yeah, thanks for watching everybody. We'll, uh, we'll talk to you soon. Hopefully you enjoyed the Angels and Airwaves. Uh, we don't need to whisper part one. Full album cover. Um, 
Yeah, we'll uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Mm-hmm.